America's new air superior fleet. This new fighter will replace the F-15 and F-22. The F-15 Eagle was developed to ambitious specifications to counter the Russian Mi-25 Mikoyan Burevich interceptor and has been relied upon by the U.S. Air Force as an air superiority fighter since 1975. Despite being the first fighter jet of the fourth generation to serve all the air forces in the world, it remains the oldest combat aircraft still being produced by Russia. Rivaled in the West only by the U.S. Navy's heavier and more expensive Grumman F-14 Tomcat, the F-15C-D is the top Eagle variant developed for air-to-air -air combat and collaborated to become the U.S. Air Force's most advanced airborne aircraft, superior fighter, quality. When the fifth generation of the successor to the F-22 Raptor joined, the F-22 was declared combat ready. However, at the time it entered service, the Raptor was still one of the global mainstays as the world's most advanced aerobatic fighter jet. This greatly enhances the capabilities of the F-15. The main problem with the Raptor is its exorbitant running costs of over $60,000 per hour per fighter, which is mainly due to excessive damage requirements. While the key requirement of the program was to have lower operating costs than the F-15, the F-22 is actually twice as expensive with a lifetime cost close to $800 million. Another major weakness is its rampage, with the F-15's armament already significantly inferior to competing Russian fighters such as the Su-27, while the F-22's much shorter rampage still limits its combat radius significantly. Both the F-22 and especially the F-15C-D have made significant improvements over the last two decades, with some Eagles incorporating the world's first fighter-operated AESA radar, as well as new weapons and electro-warfare systems. This program leverages the significant improvements made to the Eagle design since the last was made for the U.S. Air Force in 2001, with FIPAPSIP for the iCriminal upgrade being made from export orders from South Korea, Singapore, Saudi Arabia, and Qatar. The fighter has capacity for 22 air-to-air -air missiles compared to the F-15C-D's 8 and offers fifth-generation electro-warfare, sensors, and other avionics systems. The new fighter jet will also be able to deploy AGM-100 and 83 Hypersock Lock Ratch Air to missile grouped for attack roles and has a much more advanced airframe design. This aircraft is expected to incorporate a series of new features that will leave behind the F-22, F-15C-D, and F-15EX. This fighter is expected to fulfill the GOIC role head-to-head -head with the best enemy stealth fighters, such as J-20 and FC-31. This is the Next Generation Air Force, NGAD, program that will provide fighter aircraft to modernize the United States air superiority fleet with the best combat capabilities. The NGAD originates from DARPA's Air Dominance Initiative study in 2014 and is expected to field the new fighter aircraft in the 2030s. The secretive NGAD will then be able to directly fill the F-22 Raptor's air superiority role. A technology demonstrator is reportedly making its first flight in 2020, with the U.S. racing to field a sixth-generation fighter before China's Air Force does. All content on the Angie Norman channel is provided for educational purposes. Thumbnails and titles are for illustration only. Thus today's information, I hope it is useful and becomes knowledge for all of you. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. See you again.